the sound asleep. Now we need to open up the Explorer and head over to our main PC, then into our C drive and then into the Windows folder. Here scroll all the way down until we can see the System32 folder and Syswell64 folder. Now for the 32-bit users. You need to drag your file into the System32 folder. The 64-bit users need to drag their file into the System32 folder and then also into the Syswell64 folder. Now we can close all these windows, but in order to be sure that the DLL file will be loaded as it should, just restart your PC, just in case. <laughs>